That's right, Slurpers Wanted. You see the sign right there. Oyster Lovers <laughs> Unite. Shock Portland kicking off in less than an hour. And Leaf joins us now. So tell us what exactly is Shock Portland? You know, it's a first of its kind oyster festival here in Portland. Uh, we are uh, raising funds to restore native oyster populations on the Oregon coast. Okay, so it lasts all week long. Yep. And can everybody get involved still? Yeah. I know some things are sold out. Yeah, so we've got a, a series of events that are going to be hosted right through Shuck Portland itself. But we have a 19 different restaurants that are participating restaurants in Portland where you can go and dine at these restaurants, eat a couple oysters, and that will help support Chuck Portland as well. Incredible. And then you're going to go to the coast, right, in March? Yeah, so we're saving all the oyster shells, 10,000 oyster shells from this week. We're going to bring them over to the coast, seed them with little juvenile oysters, put them wow. out in the bays, and restore the native oyster populations on the coast. That is absolutely Isn't incredible. It is so cool. Mylene is over here. Yes. Mylene, what is your favorite kind of oyster? You know, I love all types of oysters, but right now the goose points and the kumi eyes are just showing so beautifully. They're shining. They're bright. Do you want to shuck one? Yes, yes let's do, do this. It. Will you show let's me how do it's do done, it. girl? The one Absolutely. thing we don't want to do is what? You don't want to use your hand like this. See, you I see people do that all the time. All is the that time. a rookie move? Um, I think <laughs> it's just a tendency to want to hold this, these lovely bivalves. But, but don't wanna, do it. Don't do it. All Always right. have your, your towel here to protect your hand. Hold your knife, your beautiful knife. You have these gorgeous Murphy knives that were donated for Shuck Portland. Hold your knife at a 45 degree angle. Wiggle, wiggle, pop. Okay. And then we have a beautiful little muscle that's on top, and we're just going to detach it. Oh, I love very that. Very gently, without piercing the belly. Okay. And then look at that. And then you have a little muscle down here. So once you remove that muscle, it's ready for you to just enjoy. And, and do you always slurp. flip it over as well? I don't flip it over. Oh, I you like don't to flip. Just keep it intact this way. Um, Is that one for me? This one's for you. Oh, great. Are you going to cheers with oh, me? Absolutely. Let's do it. Let's okay, cheers, cheers to this. I like the goose points. I like the big ones typically. Yeah. Okay. Cheers. Mmm, that's actually very good, mm. very salty. And really quickly, Matt, we want to pair this with what? Yes, yeah, so well, we've got a, um, an old fashioned we're going to be building. Okay, um, we've got to make it quick, but yeah. I know you know how yeah, to do exactly. it. <laughs> um, we've got a couple ounces okay. of the Angel's Envy okay. um, bourbon, as well as what our secret weapon for tonight is Muscatel. Ooh, mm -hmm. love that. Um, and a little bit of sugar syrup. Okay. And this is where you do the dash of things that I right, love. Right, exactly. So we're going to do a couple dashes of aromatic bitters and a couple dashes of orange bitters. Put some nice spicing in there. All right. Yeah, and all of this is so good. It's going to be light and fresh and yeah, go perfectly exactly. with your oysters. Yeah. And then we and shake then stir, it. Stir it up a little bit. I love this. Yeah. Okay. Send it home. So, and then we'll end this with a little bit of orange on top as well. Oh, look yeah. how pretty. How long have you been making this, the old oh, fashioned? You know, well, the old fashioned I've been making almost uh, 30 years now, but, but this particular one just for tonight. Ah, uh, so, just yeah. for tonight, the mm -hmm. oyster social. Well, thank you guys so much. I'm going to indulge in some more of these oysters. Cheers to that. Back to you guys. Cool. Boy, you did it the hard way. She took it down with no sauce or anything on it, just right then there. quickly turns and he says, let me pour the bourbon in. Yeah. And, you know, I mean. Get rid of that oyster <laughs> taste with a nice cocktail. Thanks, Mackenzie.